the Gemstone Enhancement Chart. All right, welcome back, everybody. My name is Guy. I got another hour to spend with you. It is noon here, East Coast time. We got lots of really great stuff coming up in the show. We know you're spending a lot of time outdoors, so you know we're, we're trying to figure out a way or ways that you can enjoy it even more. I wanted to single out one item that's in the show, and it's finally back. And uh, <clears throat> excuse me, these are our Bell and Owl disc lights. All right, so these are awesome. Uh, top to bottom, you're not gonna beat it. You are getting an eight pack of these for $39.95. They dropped the price $10 for us. And these are the ones that you can angle. These are the ones I love, all right? Uh, you can situate them to, to shine onto any angle of your property. So if you want them to reflect up against your house or up on a tree, they don't just lay flat unless you want them to. You can angle them. They're amazing. They are a huge customer pick. I, uh, I expect them to sell out in this airing. Uh, there's only, uh, there's a handful of them to go around. I am available in two body colors. I am in the stainless or the bronze. And everybody will get eight. Put them anywhere and everywhere, no maintenance, built-in batteries that are rechargeable with solar power and no wires. I love those, that's coming up a little bit later. But if you are getting our today's special or any of our other outdoor items and you're outside and you're looking for a way to protect you and your family from bugs, all right? And I mean, it could be inside your house, outside your house, you wanna get rid of them. This is called our No More Bugs uh, Mega Set. This is our bug repellent. Yes, you can spray this on your body. It smells like cedar. It's amazing. It is completely safe to do that. You can spray it on furniture, on your mattress, on your bed, on your pet bed. I spray it on all the entryways to the house and it will repel bugs. It, it, you're not trying to kill them. You want them to go away. You want to basically create a force field, which is what this does. All you do is spray it. And it's safe to spray on furniture. It is non-staining. Uh, it is made of natural cedar oil. It doesn't kill bugs. It repels them. So if you put a little on your hands and put it around your neck, mosquitoes are not gonna wanna come near you. If you put a little around the, the, uh, the, the area where you have in entryways to your door, Bugs won't want to crawl over it. Cockroaches, it doesn't matter, spiders, all kinds. In fact, let's show the bugs that it works on. And this is, I buy this by the gallon, just so everybody knows. I have a gallon of it at my house that's about half gone, and I refill it in my squeeze, squeeze bottle. <clears throat> if you live up north and you're worried about deer ticks, spray it on your boots, spray it on your pants. Fleas on your animals, stink bugs, ants, dust mites on your bed or on your furniture. Cockroaches, mosquitoes, no seams, gnats, flies, horse flies. That's six, that is 10 different bugs that this works on. Let me show you what you're gonna get. I'm sorry if I'm very passionate about this product. I love, love, love this stuff. I think it's amazing. First of all, it smells amazing. It smells like, like a cedar forest. It, is, it doesn't smell like a terrible chemical like a lot of the sprays smell like. And the stuff is awesome. So here's what you're gonna get. You're gonna get a giant bottle of our, of our uh, No More Bugs, okay? You're also gonna get two of the little travel bottles to go along with it. All this for $31.95. This comes with a little carabiner so you can clip it on your backpack uh, for your kids or you can take it to the beach with you. And it works on so many different bugs. I'm a huge fan. I'm on auto ship. We have auto ship available. Linda Day standing by. Linda. I mean, I'm sorry, it always takes me a minute to get to you. I love this stuff, love it. Hey, <laughs> well, welcome into my home, Guy. This is a product that I use all over. I use it in my kitchen, I use it on myself, my pets, outdoors, indoors, on my furniture, everywhere. Because guess what? This one product will literally take away all of these products right here. I mean, it's just amazing, right? Remember when we had to buy all these things? Well, you know, you fog one room and you, you, you have to do another. This is one product, this is cedar oil. Now this is made in the USA and this is a woman owned business, which is fantastic. And the big ingredients is cedar, or cedar, cedar oil. And the thing about this is that this is a bio-based, bio-certified product that's from the USDA, right? So that's a certificate that says this is safe, 
for you, for your family, your pets, your garden, everywhere you can spray it anywhere. And the, what I want you to do is I want you to like be comfortable with this because this is, has no chemicals. You don't have to use any of these anymore. Now, what I want you to do when you get this home, what I want you to do is you're going to spray around the baseboards. You're going to spray around your doors, your windows, spray it on your furniture. Your puppy dog might have been on that furniture. Remember, they can carry little fleas, little bugs. You want to make sure that you spray it there. So take out this. This is when you get this ship, you just take your thumb, release this out of here, undo this, and now you're going to fill up your travel bottles. Notice you have a carabiner, so you can clip it to your golf bag, you can clip it to your belt loop. You're going to get a sponge. The sponge in water is going to look like this. You have directions here if you want to dilute it for using maintenance. I'll get to that in just a minute. But first, I want to just like point out, this is what I use on my countertop guy this is some i can eat off of this would i put a chemical on this no i would never do that meat on this right this is deep free this is using cedar oil let's come over here because i want to show you that when it comes to my kitchen guy and a lot of you will have those ghost ants and where do they come from they'll come right where that backsplash and your countertop meat so what i want you to do is i want you to spray liberally all around that let it dry same thing, sometimes people get the ghost ants right inside of their drain. So I want you to spray the drain at night before you go to bed, just let it sit there, right? Same thing underneath your cupboards. But I do wanna point out, especially like living in New York for so long, we used to get cockroaches in the drawer and it would be disgusting. So take your silverware out, spray your drawer, you can wipe it down, you're getting the sponge, let it dry, and when it's dry, you can put your silverware in. Remember, this is going to be safe for you, your pets, your animals, everybody, your kids. One of the things, too, I want you to make sure that you spray around your, your doors and also where your dog or your kitty cat eat. Spray this area. This is an area right around where the baseboards are, where the bugs tend to go and they hide. You're going to spray that area. Now I can put my dog bowl there. I don't have to worry about that, that Charlie's going to be just fine. Same thing around your door. You want to spray around your door as well. These are some of the places that I use it in my home. You're going to love it, Guy. Let me just tell you this. I want you to try it. <clears throat> you have 30 days to try it. I have not paid in years. I have not paid for any pest service for my home, and I live in Florida. All right, the land of the palmetto buggers, we all call them in regular terms, the cockroach. I have lived in Arizona. Spiders, all kinds of other, spiders are terrible in Arizona. I have never paid uh, in the last two years in Florida for pests interior or exterior because I use this right here, so you can see the name, and I also use my pest repellers from Bell and Howell. That's my one-two punch. So I am telling you, so I create a barrier and I spray all the barriers with no more bugs. It works. And as I said before, if they made a cologne out of this, I would buy it. It smells that good. I get so sick and tired. You know, there's a one syllable uh, bug killer out there. Y'all know what I'm talking about. I'm not, I don't want to poo poo all the other retail people out there. But if you spray, they try to mask it with a perfume. It is awful. If you spray it around your refrigerator, it smells like bug spray and it completely ruins your appetite. This smells like the woods. All right, and, and it works. You know, what they do in those bug sprays is they put all kinds of weird petroleum products and all kinds of toxic things that kill bugs. Let me ask you a question. Is killing a mosquito or a cockroach gonna get rid of mosquitoes and cockroaches? No. They were here before you and I were here, and they're gonna be here after we're done. All right, they are, they're the oldest living species, right? When you think about some of the oldest, the insects, right? And this is, gonna, this is gonna make them stay away. You're not gonna, it's not gonna kill them. I don't need dead bugs crawling around my house, half, half dead. I wanna repel them. That's what this does. You spray it and it creates a borderline where the bugs and the insects don't wanna go. Uh, Linda, would you explain that? Because insects, they breathe differently than we do, right? They do. So um, they have their, so we have our spinal cord on the inside of our bodies, right? 
Well, theirs is on the outside. Their shell is on the outside and they're ectoskeletal and they breathe through that shell. So the one thing that you do is when you put on any kind of this, you're no more bugs, the cedar oil, what happens is that when they smell it and they're breathing in, it chokes them out so they don't go near a place. It would be like us going into a room without oxygen. We'd never do it, right? Because we couldn't breathe. That's why they stay away from your home. That's why they stay away from yourself. Now, I am in this. I'm on my deck. Now, I have just planted these, and they're doing great. But guess what? I have turned this place into a mosquito haven. So I put a little uh, hook here, and I always have my no more bugs. So any of my friends, any time that we, like, hang out here, I make sure I say spray yourself down. I always, before I entertain out here, I spray the furniture. Now, the nice thing is that the cedar oil, it goes on a little milky, but it never stains. You're going to love that. You're gonna love that you can spray it all over. I spray it here, the mosquitoes don't come around. Another thing I do is I love this because look, I have this right on my golf bag. And when I go golfing, I spray liberally my visor. Anything that I'm wearing, I spray myself down. If I'm going to go hiking, let me tell you, I love hiking, right? But the one thing that I do is I keep this in my hiking bag. But to your point, and you were talking about ticks and fleas, make sure that you like really get your, your shoes, your socks in here. Because ticks and fleas, they can come and, and just like ravage you and we all know that i even put it in my hair it's safe enough this is deep free this is using a bio-based bio-certified this means that united states department of agriculture has stamped this as this is safe for you and your family now notice i have my beach bag and maybe i'll play a little tennis later i don't know maybe a little pickleball but i'll tell you what i do bring i bring this with me of course i have my carabiner I can clip it right here. And to be honest with you, sometimes when I go on a picnic, I bring the full thing because I'm spraying down my picnic table. And you can do that under your umbrella at night. You can spray under there. Just a few different places you can spray it. But you are going to be so much more comfortable because when I spray this on me, and obviously I use a small this here. And one of the things that I love about this, notice how this is like a really fine mist. What I like about this is it also has a little locking toggle here. So when I spray this and I go deep woods hiking, I spray it in my hair, I spray it all over. This is what happens, guy. The mosquitoes come because I am a buffet. They get near me yep. and they never Lin land on me. Linda? I hear them, but they never land on me. You know, me. Yes. My, my son's girlfriend, Lily, she likes to come over to the yeah. house and they like to go to sunset. She would not sit outside on her patio because she got eaten alive by mosquitoes right, right, right when it's dusk. And I said to her, and this is a true, swear, a true story, I said, Lily, try this. She sprayed it on her hands, she put it on her ankles, she walked outside right. and we watched mosquitoes get near her and go away. I was like, there it is. And she's like, oh my gosh, my mother, my mother needs this. She's get, she gets eaten alive. I don't know why they seem to attack females so much. I, I don't, they don't come after me as much. Maybe just because you're sweeter than us. I don't know. But it, 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 but it works on anybody and everybody. You know, maybe it's your blood type. I don't know. But get it home. You're going to love it. Linda, wonderful job as always. Thank you so much. I love Thank this Thank you, stuff. guy. All right, darling. Yes, it is great. Have a good All time. All right. We'll see you a little later. All right, we're gonna move on. Am I, where am I going? Out there? All right, let's go out. Let's go out into the heat and let's talk about uh, a pole saw. So I have owned, uh, I bought my first Earthwise uh, pole saw about six years ago. I just bought a new one about a year ago. I had it for five years. I used it all the time and I just got a brand new one. Um, and I love me a pole saw. Why? because I can make firewood, I can trim trees, I can cr uh, cut down branches, I don't have to get on a ladder. We are doing our beautiful eight amp corded pole saw today at the lowest price we have ever done. Where do you see the price, all right? Normally these are 79, 99, 109, 129. Today we are doing it, I believe it's 69, 69. 95, the lowest price we have ever done with this. What do I love about this pole saw? First of all, 
It is lightweight. It only weighs about, it's under 10 pounds. You can telescope it so you can open it up and make it as long as you need so that when I am cutting things, I don't have to go way, way up on a ladder. I can reach anything that I need to reach standing firmly on the ground. I can articulate the pole saw itself by turning the button. So now I can turn it on an angle. This is the bar and chain. Uh, you'll notice this is a 10 inch bar and chain. This one's actually bigger than mine, the, the bar and chain. That's just the amount it'll cut. So this will cut a branch anywhere that is within that diameter right there. So if you have branches, you know, that are that big, it'll take them right down. There is no maintenance on this. The only thing you need to do right here is a little dial is we will give you chainsaw oil, a little, a little bottle of it. You pour it in, put the cap back on. There's a window. Let me turn this around like this. There is a window right here and you'll see that'll turn black. That means it's full of oil. That just lubricates the saw as it's spinning round and round and round. I'm, I'm just telling you, don't be afraid of this. It is so easy to use, and when you get out and you're cutting down limbs that are hanging over your driveway, branches that are hanging in front of your picture window, you will absolutely love it. Uh, my buddy Peter is back. Peter is gonna finish out uh, the show with me today. Peter, I, the, I think the first Earthwise thing I ever bought was a pole saw. And I love this sure. one. Yep. Yeah, you know what, Guy, I just listened to everything you said, and you talk about, you know, how we have so many great features on this pole saw. And what I was hearing is that this is the perfect pole saw for everyone at home, just like you and I, Guy, that, you know, we've used it. This is built for the things that we do at home. This is built to make sure that we can clear those branches that are a little too high, maybe near the driveway, getting close to the cars, or maybe they get close to the roof and the windows. You're going to be able to take care of that. You're going to be able to handle branches 10, 11, 12 feet in the air because this is so easy to use. Nine pounds. It will extend over nine feet. And then obviously I'm six feet tall, but however tall you are, you can extend that even further. But let's just show everyone how it works and how you talked about it. It's not intimidating. So what's nice about it is that I'm also on the back end of this, so I'm not near where the action's happening, but I can fire that up and just rest that down on the wood. Now I'm just letting the saw do the work for me. Just let it work its way through there. And I'm using some very hard wood today. But what's cool about this is you're not hanging on for dear life. You're just letting that saw work its way through without issue. And it's not intimidating. You're back here. As soon as you let go of that trigger, it stops and you're ready to go. So for anyone who's never used a chainsaw or a pole saw, you're trying to decide whether you want a chainsaw or a pole saw, I say go for this. This pole saw can do it all, and it's built for everyone at home watching right now. Peter, at $69.95, <laughs> wow. I, I bought my, my I original. When I first bought mine, I paid $129.95 for our first pole saw. My, the one I just bought last year, the new one, because I bought, I mean, I, Peter, I had my last pole saw almost six years. I mean, that's a really sure. good run for a, for a chainsaw. Uh, so, but, but I just bought the last one, and with my discount, it was like 89 bucks. This is $69.95, all right? And it's so easy to use, all right? I mean, all you gotta do, like I said, you put a little oil in the, in the thing. We give you the oil when you get ready. Uh, make sure you're wearing protective glasses. And remember, I'm way back here. I'm nowhere near the blade. So it's, much, it's a much safer saw to use. I'm just gonna lay it on. The, the weight of the saw is enough to be able to cut it. Little trick I'll tell you is start the saw before you put it on the wood. So it has a little bit of a head start. So I got it going, watch. And then I just let it sit right on top. Done. I'll do it again. Nothing. Easy. That is how easy. One more. I mean, and look at how clean that cut is. Look at that clean cut. That is how easy, and there's no combustion engine, there's no gas, I don't have to pull start anything. All I do is give right. it a little squeeze. There's a double uh, 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 trigger, safety trigger. I will be honest, this is not for your kids. It's for grown-ups or kids that you trust that are old enough to handle it. But the fact is, I think what people are afraid of with a regular chainsaw, Peter, your hands with a regular chainsaw are only a few inches away from the blade. With this, yeah. you are five to nine feet away from the blade, you know? Yeah, exactly. And 
with this one, you talked about how you have the safety features built into the handle. When you let go, everything stops. With those gas-powered handheld chainsaws, you are close to it. The motor is always running, even sometimes when the chain isn't actually going. But this is not intimidating, as you just showed, as I was demonstrating. But what's so nice is that it's also professional quality that you're getting that 10-inch bar and chain. It's an Oregon bar and chain, which is the industry standard that you're going to see on those much more expensive professional chainsaws. So you're getting that. Just like you always talk about guy in the kitchen, you want a sharp knife because that's a safer knife. Same kind of concept here. Also, so lightweight, you're going to love it with that fiberglass pole. But I want to show you this, how we can extend this out by doing this there we go extend this out and i lock that collar in place now you can also extend it from the back as well so what happens with that is that you can extend it so you can balance it on both sides so now look at this when i extend this to its full nine feet three inches plus me standing here i mean look at how high I can grab, I can cut limbs because you're so high up there, still cutting at a 45 degree angle. Now watch this. I know you know this already, guy. This is our only chainsaw pole saw that has that articulating motor at the top. So you can be at the perfect angle when you go up onto those tree limbs, you can get that perfect angle. Also, that motor is in line. There's no big motor on the side, which kind of blocks your view when you're up overhead. You're doing all this safely. You're doing it without being on a ladder, which makes it ultimately much safer. You're going to love using this. And, Guy, then I think we can really talk about all the chances you'll have to use this when you get it home. And, and hey, we'll be honest, you're not going to use it every day. But I guarantee you're going to use it at least a couple of times a month. That's why sure. $69.95 is such a great deal for, for this company uh, from, from Earthwise. And, and, you know, they stand behind their product. You get a two-year warranty on this. I had my first one for almost six years, and I used it a lot. In fact, the way, I, the way, it, finally, the way it finally kicked, I was using it at my neighbor's yard. And I was using it because, you know, my neighbor uh, didn't have a way to get up all, and do all these trees. And I was using it for literally like two and a half hours one day. <laughs> and I just, I, I just used it too much. It just got too hot. But that was six years. I had it for, these things are built to last. You're going to absolutely love them. They're easy to maintain. All you do is make sure there's a little oil. You only have to fill it with oil about once every five or six months. All right. And that's it. It's maintenance free. No pull starting. No worrying about mixing gas and oil. No big time noise that you get with a regular. And by the way, I've used regular chainsaws on several occasions. I had a, uh, for a very good friend of mine uh, in Tennessee who had a, uh, they had a really bad storm and a, uh, a giant tree fell on his storage barn. So we were up there cutting it. They are not easy to use. You can't, I mean, you really got to know what you're doing with this. Put on your goggles, plug it in, find the tree, cut it off that's all you need to do and i you know it's funny peter when we first started presenting these whenever we would ask for callers peter who would always call in yeah it would always be the ladies ladies who never thought <laughs> that they could ever use a pole saw right. exactly yeah they yeah, would call it, in and they would give easy. their yeah they'd give their testimonial and they'd be like it weighs less than 10 pounds it weighs less than right. my vacuum or any other you know mop that i have that's heavy duty or, or, or carpet cleaner i can easily get out there and i can do it myself and peter you and i live in florida if somebody wanted to come and trim our palm trees what would they charge us well it per palm tree yeah so if you have eight ten palm trees you know 50 75 dollars per tree yeah. now honestly i have some of these giant oak trees now i definitely can't get all the way up into the oak trees to trim them back because they're so tall but what i've noticed is that the parts that get really close to the driveway i can do so much of it that i don't have to have a professional come more than every two or three years which is great let me just do some more cutting so i want people to again see how easy this is how you don't have to hold on to dear life remember it weighs nine pounds but just that six or so pounds that's at the front of the unit. So the motor, which is about six pounds, that's just going to work its way through the cut. Whether you're doing it just in front like I am or you, you have it up overhead, remember, that's going to work its way through. You talked about that automatic oiling system, oiling that bar and chain automatically. Again, these are 
high-end features. What's nice about it is they're features you don't have to worry about. You just have to know that this is not intimidating. And guy, why I have you here, let's just show everyone again the safety. That's what we're all about. So I try to pull that trigger. I can't pull that trigger unless I hit the safety fit, fit button first and then hit the trigger. And as soon as I let go, I can't go back to the trigger. Always have to hit that safety switch as well. So you're never gonna accidentally start it. And when you let go, it stops. So again, safety is huge. Earthwise has thought of everything. You're getting a two-year warranty, which is twice the industry average. And again, this has the features that you want for the jobs you're going to do. You're going to use it now. Things are growing. But I think one of the best times, and I know you know this guy, is in the fall. Get everything cut back before the winter time. That's a great time to use your pole saw year or when you've got branches after a uh, ice storm that are hanging over oh, your car yeah. you pop this in plug it in and you can take those things right down without waiting for somebody and you know you'll wait forever in a storm for somebody to come help you you know i think peter what we learned after the pandemic last year is that the more we could do on our own the better we are off in the long run, right? Less exposure to other folks. Uh, not only that, but you know, that now everybody is so busy because the world is back out sure. there and on fire again, going crazy with needing stuff. You can do this yourself. This, this pole saw right Absolutely. here. I'll get it back straight, lock it in. You can use this. It is not too heavy. It is not clumsy. It is not intimidating whatsoever. You're going to be able to cut through anything. All right. And if you're just using it to make firewood, uh, you know, if you're using it in the fall and you want to trim down branches, winter time, you get a big branch hanging over full of ice. You know, maybe right now is a great time because we're still doing cleanup as we get into summer. It, and, and yes, you're not going to use this every day. You may not use it every week, but I will guarantee when it comes time to trimming your trees, you will go to this before you get on a ladder. And I always say to people, Peter, do not get oh, on yeah. a ladder do it. with any kind no. of a power tool. Don't do it. Yeah, exactly. And you're not going to have to. I have this resting on the ground. It's nine feet, yeah. three inches high. But here's the amazing part. This aluminum and fiberglass, it weighs nine pounds. So you can handle this. And I yeah. think that's ultimately what's so hey. important. Not intimidating. You can do it. It's going to work, guy. It really will. All right, Peter, before I let you go, do we let Peter go? All right. Uh, hey, Peter, will you talk about the uh, real mower for just about 30 seconds real quick? Because that's coming uh, up. Yeah, the real mower is fantastic. It's a five blade mower. It's super easy to push. So guy, you and I think about that as being old technology, but we've got all the new materials with the best way to mow your lawn. So when you see this, it's got the trailer wheels, it's got the adjustments, it's got everything plus these updated materials. It really is the easiest, the most eco-friendly and the best way to get the best looking lawn ever. Yeah, we have about a thousand of these to go. I'm sorry, Rob, what did you say? All right, we are down to less than 700 of these, and this is the larger one. So if you've got a larger yard, don't worry. It's quiet, no maintenance, no gas. Yeah, I, mean, I guess you could spray a little WD-40 on the wheels every so often, but it comes with a grass catcher. I love this thing. It's quiet. You can mow the lawn at 5 in the morning. Nobody will be upset. That is coming up in a little bit. Stick around. We've got more, including our super cool disc lights and a quick 5 and 5 right after this. They say home is where the heart is. So when I'm at home, I want it to feel warm and welcoming and full of things that make me smile and make life just a little bit easier. So join me every Tuesday for your weekly look at the latest ways to make your home a haven. We're making bigger, even better with our supersize values, and they're available only at HSN. Supersize values are based on the price per ounce of the same item in a smaller size. However, they do not reflect a price at which HSN would sell the item. Have questions? Call us at 1-800-284-3900. It's the perfect time to spruce up your space during our biggest home sale of the year. We've got home products for indoors and out, all at special prices. Kitchen, cleaning, organization, grilling, and more. Shop now because these prices won't last. It's everything you need to clean up, organize, and decorate your home this summer. Our biggest home sale of the year, now through tomorrow on HSN and at hsn.com.
right, everybody. So we're going to do what we call our quick five and five, which is five really cool products. We got handfuls left of each. Yes, I have the color version of this incredible wind spinner. Uh, this is called our Flora Solar Powered Wind Spinner. I have it in two different colors. I have it in bronze and I have it in multi. Why do I love this? Most wind spinners need wind. This one does not. This one has a solar panel on the back of it. Now we're not in the sun right now, but it has a solar panel on the back. And when you point that to the sun, it charges it. So it'll, even if there's no wind, when it's hitting the sun, they spin. See, there's the solar panel. So you don't have to rely. If it's a dead, kind of a quiet day, it still spins around. They are on sale, $79.95. Uh, there is the, I have fewer than a thousand to go around. That's the bronze one. It's so cool. They're like little reflective bowls that spin around in a circle. They are so beautiful. I like the multicolor. Uh, that's available as well. Uh, you got our price right there, 739-659 is the item number. If you are looking to create the look of real stone on your pathway, but you don't want to lift the stones, we have our cho uh, choice of garden, uh, what they're called faux garden stones. You get eight of these, all right? Eight of these, and they stick right into the ground. All you do is take them, put them out in the ground, press them down, and they look exactly like stone. I mean, they're really, they look like slate. They are super duper cool. I just knocked that one over, excuse me. But anyway, I am available in colors. They are available in the black. This is the brown. And then this one over here is the gray. So you could get, uh, you get um, eight of these uh, included. So if you need to make a little walkway out to your shower, perfect for that. All right, item number 735597. Wow, their clearance price, 20 bucks. Now you can get a couple of sets of them. All right, next item, and we're very limited on this as well. This is our Apollo outdoor privacy screen. So you ever have an area of your home that maybe you're not too crazy about, it's kind of a dead area? Well, this is cool. All right, it is 16 uh, and a half uh, a feet in length by about three feet high. You can cut it to size and you can attach it anywhere. So if you want to put it on, you know, where your recycle bins are, across a fence, uh, you could just string it up. It comes with all the attachments that you need. It was $29.95. Today it is only $19.95. What a great way to hide something that maybe you're not all that crazy about. Or if you like to sunbathe on your deck and you don't want people to look through the bars to see you, you could just put one of these up. Uh, your color choices available are faux stone, which is right here. We also have it in gray over here. And then we have it in the tan color as well. There's the faux stone. So you'll see how it's pretty nice, right? Just a big giant tarp that you could protect yourself with. 1995-730-495. All right, and hey, you get both of these? Oh, look at these. These are peanut butter feeders, right? For your birds, right? Whatever you want. You simply put it in there. It comes with the peanut butter. You get a two pack of these, they're on clearance. You know birds love peanut butter, right? Hang it from a wire if you don't want those blasted squirrels to get at it. Uh, you'll feed all your favorite birds in the front yard and the backyard too. They were $29.95. Uh, you get the feed, that's included, the peanut butter feed. Open the jar, slide it in the little house, hang it from a tree. You wanna see birds, cardinals, robins, not blue jays. Blue jays are bad. I know, they're pretty, but they're bad. They steal other birds' eggs. All right, that's my commentary on birds. But get it home for $16.95. A little place for them to hang out and get a snack. You can, they won't come to your yard unless you bring them the food. And then finally, we have our wind and weather uh, mosaic globe and mister set. So these are really cool. So one is to mist your plants, right? When you want to mist your plants, put a little water in there, whatever it is. This one's out of water, but you get it. And the other one is actually a garden spike that you put into the, your plants to feed them water when you're, not away, when you're not around. These are beautiful. They are glass and ceramic. They're not plastic. They're real glass and ceramic. And you will get both. You'll get the peanut butter, of, not the peanut butter, you'll get the, the sprayer and you will get the, uh, the, the watering spike both for $17.95. I am available in the blue chevron in the middle. The one over here is multicolor. It's the one I like. Look at that. Pretty. And then we also have them in, uh, this is called pink ladybug. It's just ladybug. Everybody gets two, $17.95. I might buy these today. You know what my problem is? When I go away, I don't water the plants. 
Stick one of these out there. Boop. Perfect. All right. That is our five and five. Come on over with me. We're going to take a little walk. And uh, this is my pick of this hour. Why? Uh, I just think it's one of the best things that we that we do here and that we offer here. These are our Bell and Howell disc lights. These have been gone for a while. We were able to get some back in, in both the uh, stainless steel and in the bronze. The reason I love these so much is that these are the ones that you can actually swivel. So if you wanna put them on the ground, they're regular disc lights, but if you wanna stake them in or whatever, you can actually swivel the light to hit any angle you want. So if you want it to go up at the house, or if you want it to go up at a tree, or if you want to have it go the other direction, these actually swivel. These are the best made um, solar lights that we have here available. They are 305 stainless steel. You will never replace a battery. You will never plug anything in. There is no wiring. The sun charges them during the day. At night, there's the angle I was telling you about. At night, they come to life. You are getting not two, four, six, eight of these in your choice of body color. Let me introduce to our special guest, uh, my very good friend, Lou Caputo. Lou, I love the swivel, baby. I love the swivel. <laughs> you know what? It is a really unique feature about these, the fact that you can actually aim this light. Because once upon a time, when you bought solar lights, you had to buy just the regular solar lights that would go down or up or whatever direction. But then you have to buy special spotlights. And you don't have to do that now because these all have that ability to swivel and aim that light. Now, what's neat about these is, as you were pointing out, they are all 305 stainless steel. So you're getting quality here from Bell & Howe, regardless of the color that you choose. The other thing is, yes, you can use them flat on their backs. We give you stakes for all of them. So every piece in this eighth pack that you're getting is going to have a stake so you can stake into the ground. When you stake these into the ground, that's where you get that maximum deflection of the light, where you can actually rotate this all the way around 360 degrees, aim it down if you want to, aim it to either side, straight up, whatever you want to do, that's how they work. Or you can mount them on a post as I have over here. I've got one sitting on top of a fence post, but then we mounted one to the front of the fence post. And why can we do that? Because we have what's called a keyhole on the back of this right there. So you can just hang this on a nail or anything like that that you want to. But I'm gonna bring my lights down just so you can see how nice these look and the effect that you get. Now look at that. You get this really cool glow off of these. And again, you can can aim that light guy wherever you need it. Look at that. I can go straight down. I can go up with it. Whatever direction I want, these Bell & Hell solar lights are going to give you that unique look that you only get from Bell & Hell. Let's be honest, Lou. They're easy. <laughs> they are easy. <laughs> they, they are, are easy. easy. And if you love, you know, <clears throat> listen, when I first moved to Arizona, that's the first time I had, buy, it was, uh, was that my first, yeah, it was first house I bought. I bought, I was up in North Phoenix, and of course, I was all excited to put in lights. So I had to yep. run, I had to dig trenches, and I, I didn't have any money, so, you know, we just bought a house, so I was like, I gotta do this myself. So I ran, I actually, you ever try to dig in the ground in Arizona? Uh, not easy, folks, it is all clay. So I would actually, I was out there with like a hoe and a chisel trying to get wires. If I had had these in Arizona, my life would have been so easy, and you gotta pay for the power to run them, you have to set the timers. There's nothing to do with these, you just take them outside and put them on the ground. Lay them flat yeah. on the grass, put them under a plant, put them on a sidewalk. Because there's no wires, they're safe around a swimming area, around a pool, and that angle swivel is everything. All right, we are very busy. I knew we would get busy on these. I have not offered these in a while. Read the reviews, huge customer pick on hsn.com. I think my brother Darren has like six sets of these things. He buys them every time they're on air. He's like, guy, these things are awesome. And again, he's got a lot to do. The last thing he wants to do is wire uh, solar lights or, or if you, and you know, when you try to buy solar lights at a home store, they're very yeah. expensive. You know, it's funny. They're, they're, they're more expensive than the regular wired lights. They barely even carry those anymore. And you're not gonna get eight for $39.95. All right, they're usually, they're, they can be anywhere from $20 to $30 a piece for a regular mounted solar light. Get these, yeah. $39.95, you get eight of them. You can put them anywhere. They immediately make your house look better. They improve your curb appeal. They make your house safer because if I'm a ba bad guy or a burglar, I'm not going to the, to the lighthouse, I'm gonna go to the dark house. Right. So get these right. out there. And, and again, Lou, best made, best quality. 
Oh yeah, and you know what? It's instant curb appeal too. Because I don't, you know, when we bought the house we live in now, we came here during the daytime. We came on weekdays. We came on weekends. We came by at night too, because we wanted to see what the neighborhood was like at night. Yeah. And one of those, you know, right now with the housing market being what it is, if you can add something this simple to your house and get that extra, you know, judge that extra curb appeal from it, that's exactly what these are going to do without any wiring, without any hiring. You don't have to bring in an electrician. You do this all yourself. Now you were talking about how you can go to the home improvement stores and they do charge a lot of money for solar lights it's crazy and usually they're not as bright and not only that but they'll sell you like a huge package of them okay for some ridiculous price but they're all down lights okay bell and house solar lights our disc lights are up lights and that means that that light goes up or through anything on top of it. So if I turn the lights off in here, right away you see we get that lovely glow coming from these. But I can use these even at a party. I can use it as a coaster. I can set it down there like that. And it's a fun look that you get from these. You can use these around your pool deck. You can put them in your potted plants if you want to. I mean, I've got these set up so that I can aim these lights wherever I want to. Then these are just inside of a little flower box right here. You know, Great for people that live in condos. If you want to put a couple of them out on your porch or in a townhouse, these are fantastic for that. Because again, there's no wiring required. And right there, that's such a great shot. You're getting such a great look at how much light these throw off in the alcoves that are around there in the studio. And you can see that you can actually aim those. And remember what I said earlier, if you put them in the stakes on the ground, that's where you get that maximum deflection from these, where you can actually go 360 degrees all the way around guy and really aim that up like take advantage of it put it against your house put them under your foliage outside bird bath statues trees whatever it is you've got out there even your mailboxes to show off the numbers it'll look that much better i, I like reading the reviews and, and i love i love the to hear what people great. do with them there are so many yep. great reviews it's a customer pick it's easy it's gonna I, honestly you'll, you'll come home from work at night you know and you'll be like oh my gosh look at my house Look how pretty my, my yard looks. Look at how pretty the driveway looks, right? Because you can put them anywhere. Hey, if you want to buy more, more than one set, go right ahead. They are on discount today, $10 off. Hey, Rob, did you say that we're getting limited in one color versus the other? All right, if you want bronze, 300 sets left in the bronze color. Personally, I don't think it matters what color you get, but it's totally up to you. Yeah. But if you want bronze, we are down to less than 300 there, the ones that everybody is grabbing right now. But get them. I mean, literally, we're not, we're not asking you to, to do a hard task here. We're saying, just make your yard look nicer, right? Yeah. If not for you, yeah. do it for your wife or your, or your husband or your partner or your, or your kids. Maybe you want to do this for your grandparents. It's a nice little surprise. You know, go to their house and put solar lights outside. They never have to set a timer. And Lou, do you remember the old days with the wired lights? Do you remember you, yeah. had, to buy, you had to buy the, uh, the transmitter thing, right? The box. Yep. And then you had, you, to had take, to the you had to take the little pin and figure out what time they would turn on and turn... Let, let the Lord do it, is what I say, because when the sun let goes the sun down, do the lights come yeah. on. When the sun comes yeah. up in the morning, the lights turn off. You don't do anything right. but enjoy it while you're, while you're up at night. I just love it. No, they're great for that. And you know, and I always tell people, think about using them in unconventional ways. Like Kelly and I have some on our patio set outside. We actually use them on the tables because they make, instead of candles, these, you know, especially here in Florida where it's pretty much windy all the time, it, it, they actually make a really nice ambient light to have out there. What about, you know, if at Christmas time you like to put out luminaries? A lot of people do. They put them around their property. There are neighborhoods I know where they actually do that. They Everybody buys these and then they set them out. But they always, you, know, you drive down the street and you see them on fire because... The breeze blows the flame around. This is a much better way to do it. It's a lot safer. All you got to do is take them out during the day, let them charge, and then they'll just, you know, do this all night long for you. And then, as Guy was saying, there's nothing you have to do. When the sun comes up, these are self-regulating. You never have to worry about turning these on and off. You never have to worry about daylight saving time. You don't have to worry about, you know, setting any, any timers on these. There's none of that. There's no wiring. There's no electricians. These are, bar none, the easiest way to do it. And you can use these has our traditional solar lights on their back vertically you know on the stakes but remember these are the ones you can swivel you can aim this light wherever you want to i can take that light and aim it up this way i can aim it down i can aim it all the way back around at me you can see that right there so really a huge huge benefit that you're going to get from these and remember these are all 305 stainless steel regardless of whatever color you're buying as guy said i don't know that the color really matters but whatever one you're buying they're all 305 stainless steel as opposed to like when you go out and you buy these at the home improvement stores guess what there's a mystery metal well you're getting quality 
you hear from Bell and Howell. And by the way, God, Bell and Howell's been around for over 110 years. These guys have won Academy Awards for advancements in lighting. And what they've done here is taken the very latest in LED technology. These are known as surface mount diodes. Each and every one of them is like a self-contained little LED that's perfectly flat. And that's why you get this amazing slim profile on these. Because these are the swivel, they'll stick up a little bit more than a regular disc lights. But guy, they're virtually flush mount. Yeah, you know, they're, they're so, here, I'll take this one off, put it in my hand again. So, so if, when we're talking about how you display them, if you put them on the little, on the little uh, stake that comes with it, there's a little stake that sticks on the bottom. That allows you to be able to turn them in any direction that you want. If you want, you could lay them just flat like that, like if you're doing them on a patio around a pool, or if you're just gonna put them on the grass, it's gonna grab my card that blew off here. Um, but they really, there's nothing easier, sorry about that, there's nothing easier than, than, than doing these. And, and you know, if you went, like I said, in the old days, you went to a home store, and you bought eight landscape lights, you're gonna spend 200 bucks. This is 39 for eight. And, Lou, no maintenance, right? We never have to replace a bulb. They don't burn nope. hot, they don't steam up at night like wired lights do. And, you know, a solar panel will pretty much last forever. I mean, it doesn't get, yeah. it's, it's not like it's get something that's getting used like actively. It's just soaking right. up sun and charging up a battery. The battery never needs to be replaced. The bulbs nope. never need to be, Sealed. you're, you're going to have these for years, Lou. No, you really are, and that's the thing, and that's why the 305 stainless steel is so important, because all the other components on this are made to last for like 100,000 hours when you talk about the LEDs inside of these. Guess what? The best, the rest of it better keep up with it, and that's why they went with the stainless steel. This is one of the stakes. Remember, you're getting one for every light, and all you do is just look at the holes on the back of this and just match them up like that. It takes two seconds to do. Boom. We just put it on the stake. That's all there is to it. So this is crazy, crazy easy for anybody out there to do guy this is like one of those projects you and i dream of where you yeah. open the box and you just you know you just yeah, toss I love them that out. i love that stuff lou <laughs> well lou and i tease each other all the time because you know when the pandemic hit we had we both had like laundry lists a mile long of stuff we wanted to get done and then we got really tired of that this is easy yeah if we did. I mean, this is literally out of the box watch out of the box put it on the ground all right turn the little turn the, put it on the stake which would raise it a little bit and then just angle it towards your house there it is right there yeah. It's so easy. All right, if you want bronze, I am down to about 100 sets. Wow. All right, that's how quickly the bronze went. I'm still okay in the stainless, which is actually always very popular. But you could put these in and amongst flowers. I love Lou's idea about putting them in luminaries uh, versus mm -hmm. putting, you know, putting candles in there and they always burn. <laughs> you wake up in the morning after Halloween and all the, all the bags are burned up. You don't have to worry about that. There's no energy cost. There, there's no impact on the environment. They are the easiest thing you will ever use. If you want to get them, total of all of them, I have about 950 left. So if you want to order them, you can see 500 people just picked them up in the last five minutes. Get them home, you'll love them. Lou, great job as always, my friend. Good to see you. Thanks, Scott. You too. Have a great day, everybody. All right, bud. All right. Hey, Naturally Green, very popular in the show, still available. Uh, over 600 of these gone in the show. If you want to get it and you want to get rid of ticks, cockroaches, mosquitoes, gnats, noceums, horse flies, uh, uh, um, uh, you know, what are the things in your bed? What are those things called? Not bed bugs, they didn't work on that. The other ones, dust mites, yay, I remembered it. <laughs> Dust mites, they're perfect for that, and it smells amazing. It will not stay, in fact, we'll put the bugs up that it repels. Woo, a little hot out here on a sunny day. Uh, these are the bugs that it repels, so spray it on your clothes, spray it on your boots, spray it on your skin, spray it on the, on the floors. That is still available if you wanna get it, and auto ship also available if you want that. All right, I'm gonna put down my water. We are doing a steal of a deal as the last item in our show today. Uh, this is what we call our real mower. Do you remember years ago when grandpa uh, had a push mower? And you were always like, that's pretty cool, right? Well, this is a push mower modern day with all the features that you love about a push mower. Doesn't need gas, doesn't need oil, doesn't make any noise. It gives you a, what we call the best type of cut for your grass. These, those rotary blades are the types they use on golf courses. Why? because they cut clean through grass. Regular mowers thrash 
through your grass and they leave a very um, um, uneven edge. That's why those lawns start to brown because they've been hacked off. When you scissor cut, which is exactly what a push mower does, which is why they use it on golf courses, you get a green finish and they work beautifully. If you're one of those folks that likes to cut the grass early in the morning or late at night, your neighbors will love it because it does not have an engine, so it doesn't make any noise. I have it available in green. I have it available in, in uh, blue. Uh, these weigh only 28 pounds, so they're not heavy like a regular mower. You can actually hang it from a hook you know, in the garage if you want to. We are including the grass catcher to go along with it. And I am telling you, these things are amazing. And all you do is give them a push. And I wanna show you something. This is so cool to watch because when you come in here, and I'll grab one right here. Well, it's kind of hard to see. I'll, I'll, I'll let Peter talk about it. But what you're gonna notice is that these cut completely clean on a blade of grass. All right, they, I, I'll, grab, I'll grab it and show, I'm gonna do it with a card later to show you. It's not a jagged top to the grass, it is scissor cut. It's like your hair. You know, if you get a bad haircut and it gets all frayed or you get a really clean cut, so you're not gonna get the browning on your lawn. They're easy to use. Peter Colin is standing by. I always get excited when we bring the push mower back because I know sure. it's summertime, Pete. Yeah, and I know, and I'm not just saying because you're older, guy, that you remember <laughs> what the real mowers were like when we were kids and you found that old rusty one that was in, impossible to push in the garage. And you're like, hey, what's this long mower? Now, the reason those were available then and are still available now is because exactly what you said. They really are the best way to mow your lawn, to get the, the best results. And then, so what I wanted to do is we, we can talk about that, but I want everyone to understand the features that you're getting on this one from Earthwise and which makes it the best choice when you're looking at a real mower. So 18 inch wide path, really similar to what you're gonna get on those powered mowers. I'll show you a little bit more about the actual reel. But this is a five blade reel. Each one of these is considered a blade and that's what's gonna spin. We're gonna get the trailer wheels in the back. We have the large geared wheels in the front. So these are 10 inches in the front, six inches in the back. We have nine different height adjustments so you can decide where you wanna cut your grass between one inch and all the way up to three inches. So again, these are all the things that make this such a great mower. Let me tilt it over here. I want you to see, again, what this reel is all about. So when you walk, it'll turn that blade. The gearing is so great. There's no running with this to get it to work. Even walking nice and slow, that blade moves great. And this is where we're going to see what you were talking about, Guy, how each one of these is acting like a scissor cutting that grass, and it gives you that perfect clean cut. Now, I'll show you, Guy. I'm going to show you right here. So... I'm not using the real mower at home. We have a lawn service because I'm a busy boy sometimes. So look at what it's doing to the grass right here. Yeah. That this is just impossible brown and split and hacked away at the top. And that isn't what you want to get the beautiful lawn. If you look at the two blades of grass, you know, we have a lawn service that comes out here, obviously, and cuts the grass here. The one that you're looking at that is brown, that was cut with a regular lawn mower. The one I just pulled out, out of there, which is this one here. Look at the top. Do you see how it's cut perfectly clean? That's why it doesn't turn brown. So that is why they do that on golf courses. They use that rotary type scissor blade. You'll see them, they drag it on the back and it spins around because that's the way to get that scissor cut on the grass, which enables it to get really, really low without browning. And that's the whole thing. I mean, so when you're cutting the grass, and I, you know, I'll take this mower up over here and I'll show you how well it cuts. I'm gonna go along this edge here and just show you how it works. I'm gonna put my cards under my arm and I'm just gonna cut straight through and I want you to see how beautifully that just did, that path right there. I mean, you get, you get a beautiful scissor cut lawn. It's quiet, it's not hard to push. I think a regular mower is harder to push. I mean, you can see how easy it is to get right through that. And you see, here's, look at this grass. This is everything I'm cutting. I mean, it works absolutely perfectly. And then you can mulch this or do what you want. Uh, when you have a, 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 a mower like this too, you can get out there and do it so fast that you, know, you don't even really need the grass catcher, Peter, if you don't want to use it. But I, I just think it's an old school way, lowest price we've ever done on this. And there is, Peter, there's, tell me about the maintenance. Yeah, yeah, there's nothing you have to do. Again, this isn't going to rust out like they did years and years ago. This is uh, alloy-tempered steel on that 
real, and then you've got the painted steel and the rest of it. So it's definitely going to last. So let me show. I'll do some cutting here as well because I think what's important about when you're cutting the grass, and I'll just do one, one section. You'll be able to see how well it cuts. And I'm trying to find some high grass here, and I want you to be able to see the difference on what I did. This one spot makes it super easy to go. Okay, so now you can just see the middle. What's nice about this is I'm cutting this very low. So many of us would love to have that low, beautiful, almost like the fairways of a golf course look. But if you're using that rotary gas-powered motor, if you cut that grass sh short, you know what happens. It burns the top of that. It turns brown. That's never going to happen here. You're going to be able to have that beautiful grass. It's going to grow evenly because you've cut it evenly. It just is a completely different way. And maybe you're someone who's spending a tremendous amount of time on their grass, but you're still not getting the results that you want. Try the real mower because it's going to allow your lawn to just perform better, to do its thing better without robbing it of moisture on the tips of every single blade of grass. Really, really cool throwback. I, mean, I remember my, my grandfather had one of these mowers and that was the first mower I had ever used because grandpa was like, all right, just be careful. Obviously just push forward, keep your fingers out of there. And he let me use it. It was the first mower because it was not a you know a combustion engine with, with something that could you know just chop your foot off. So he was like, try it. And I got, I got used to it and I was like, oh my gosh, I love this. It was quiet, there's no maintenance, there's no gas. You don't have to pull start it. Not only that, you know, uh, I, I've probably gone through in my life, probably gone through eight or nine uh, rotary mowers. They just don't last. I mean, you gotta, you gotta take care of the engine. You gotta put oil in it. Sometimes you gotta mix gas with the oil. Uh, they, they, they just, you know, they're, they're, they're not a machine that lasts. Yet that, that uh, rotary or the, uh, the uh, manual mower that my grandfather had, I think his father gave him that. Like, they, they're, this thing will last you for 30 or 40 years, all right? Because all you got to do is every so often, every couple of years, if you want to get the blades sharpened, you can, you can have somebody sharpen the blades for you. But remember, you're just cutting grass. And, and if something, people are like, well, what if I get a rock? If you had a rock or, or a piece of mulch or a twig, it just stops. And all you do is back it up, and it lets it out. It doesn't shoot it out like a projectile 200 miles an hour and almost kill somebody, right? It is a lot easier to be able to do it. It's fun. It's a nice little bit of exercise, Peter. I'm just using one hand here to show you. And it really works. And, Peter, you can set this, like with all the adjustments, just like you can a regular mower, right? Yeah, exactly. Between one inch and three inches, there's nine different adjustments in between that. But I think you'll find that you can go a little bit lower. And here's something that I know when you're mowing your lawn, you want to be able to do your lawn and you want to be able to turn and get those nice um, lines. You'll be able to do that with this. Again, you see this in the outfield or the ball field. You see it on the golf course. So doing that where you can just walk back and forth and get those lines, it's simple. Walk fast, walk slow. It doesn't matter. It does the job. I definitely think using it without the grass catcher is a great way to go. But if you have extremely long grass, the first time you're using this, maybe you want to use that grass catcher, which just goes in the back. But again, it really is a great way to cut. I mean, you see this grass, and it just looks perfect the way it's been cut. And if you are, again, comparing real mowers, you're thinking, you know what, I didn't want this. But how do I know that this is the one? 18-inch wide path, 10-inch wide wheels. And remember, the 10-inch, they're large wheels because the gearing is important. You don't want to have to run with the mower to get that reel to spin. Here, you don't have to do that. Trailer wheels, nine different adjustments. Again, super easy to use. And then you can hang it on the wall in the garage. It hangs right up. I love it. I, I just think, it's for my great. money, I mean, listen, you know what? For $99... To have a machine like this that is so easy to maintain. Um, and it, excuse me if I wipe my brow, it's a little bit warm out here today, but that's okay. Better than sweating all over you. Um, but it, it really is, it's, it's a wonderful tool that's been around for a long, long time. The original lawnmowers, that's what that's pretty much what they did, right? They still use this type of mower on uh, uh, golf courses so that the grass doesn't brown. It, it only weighs, what does it weigh, Peter? It's 20, how much does it weigh? Yeah, 26 pounds nothing for a mower that is nothing $99 today if you want to get it only $7.50 to ship it onto your house choose blue I'm so glad I'm surprised we have colors today too choose blue or choose green you'll absolutely love it and you won't stick up the the uh, garage either or where or your shed because there's no gas in this machine right. whatever Peter thank you buddy
Thanks, guy. Have an excellent day. I'll see you soon. I will, pal. Thank you so much for being part of the show. Thank you for being so much and joining us today. Stick around. The lovely and talented Helen Keeney will be joining you. I'll see you guys a little bit later in the week for the uh, go-to summer guy. Have a great day. This year, we're ready to party. It's our birthday. And we have 44 reasons to celebrate. Come join the fun for our 44th birthday month. Cue the confetti. We're celebrating our birthday throughout July with even more. New guests. New shows. And new favorites you are gonna love. Plus, that wouldn't be a birthday without surprises all my flock. The party is on. Birthday month kicks off Thursday at midnight only on HSN.com. Get inspired this summer at HSN with a curated collection of fresh new finds, handpicked just for you and for every part of your life. Stand out from the crowd with a style all your own. With HSN's exclusive daily deals, there's always something new to discover. All day, every day. So come summer with us this season. It's the thrill of discovery, only at hsn.com. Yeah.